Frankenstein Let's Play. I'm David Reinhardt, and I'm here with... Cameron Stark. And we're playing Oni Chambara, Bikini Samurai Squad. Indeed. Oh, D3 Publisher, I forgot they did this. Did you ever play um, EDF? Earth Defense I Force love 20. EDI. I, I have both of them. Yes, I love that game so much. The first one. I haven't played the second one. That's Toad something we could. Uh, yeah. God, why do I keep saying that? Totes. Yes. <laughs> yeah, EDF 2017. That was such a fun game. <laughs> Use two Xbox 360 controllers to play simultaneously. Oh. Do we need this? Uh, the okay, Bane full blood. The miraculous <laughs> blood bestows incredible strength. If those with it in their veins are covered in the blood of others, they can release even greater power. However, the powers of the Bane full blood have a destructive flip side. Once unleashed, the terrible forces to rampage can consume the minds of its master. Eventually devouring their very life force. God, it's like one, it's like it's not even sentences, it's just one word. <laughs> I am I, one of the last descendants of an ancient bloodline, bestowed with. This I have a very deep, curse. manly voice. My work is assassin. <laughs> my work is a sword. In the past, I fought with my half sister Saki. Now we live together. As close, as close as full sisters, the painful blood has brought me pain. Eva, who's also I'm pulling out my newspaper, I'm reading my newspaper. In her veins, attacks my sister and me. She was possessed with a desire for our painful blood. I can read it like the dialogue from Scrapland. <laughs> okay, I can't, I can't take it, we're skipping okay, it. Okay, skip like, that it. Was fun. <laughs> but we're not skipping this. Oh god, look at that V-sync. <laughs> beautiful cutscene with its yeah. I think I've seen this cutscene before. I think this was this part of the trailer like for the game or something. Ads on, that you get like while oh. you're browsing like, the pirate game <laughs> or something. It's like, come look at our video game porn, <laughs> right? <laughs> Look at that room, that is so sterile. Her eyes are weird. It's because they have been Oh, of course. And her ass crack. <laughs> and under boob. <laughs> Side boob and under boob. <laughs> God, that V sync, look at that, it's terrible. And these are pre rendered cutscenes. I know. <laughs> More ass crack. <laughs> Just like drape a towel across her back like it's a scarf. That is an effective way to dry someone. <laughs> Does that mean we get to fight like that? No. Oh my god, holy shit, that. It's just screen tearing fucking everywhere. Okay, this is pretty fun. This is pretty cool. Do this yeah, somewhere. loading, anytime they have like loading screen. Why can't I kill you? Loading screen. <laughs> <laughs> just stand here. Yeah, loading screen mini games always win in my book. Dear God. Uh. I forget. D3 Publisher was. Well, they were the. No, or were they were the developer or the publisher? I mean, they're called D3 Publisher, but I think. Wait, are we which side? Okay, let's switch sides. Yeah, we're sitting on the wrong sides. <laughs> okay. All right, so figuring out the control. Okay, already this is reminding me. I haven't played it yet, but it's already reminding me of Lollipop Chainsaw. For obvious reasons. No. That game is awesome. I know I have Shadow of the Dance. Well, just from gameplay videos I've seen of, of Lollipop Chainsaw. Maybe, like. At some level, except Lollipop Chainsaw feels a lot better. What other attacks can I do? Okay, that's a jump. Oh, 
I can run really fast when I hit B. Can you get the blood off your sword? No, I mean, what's the point of that? Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Maybe that's just... Yeah, I was doing that. What's that you do? Yeah, I guess. Also, this is the first widescreen game we're playing. Except it's kind of not because we have each one of our screen. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, he have an orb? Like, yeah, you just like sling the blood off your sword. Oh no, left trigger does something. Uh, it doesn't do anything for me. Oh. Why is kick? Did you ever play, um,. You know what that monster reminds me of? Did you ever play a uh, bullet witch? Yes. <laughs> that reminds me of you know, the, the monsters that they never do it. Like the, the giant monsters that were supposed to be like your big enemies that just stood there and took like yeah. the that game is terrible. Yeah. That's what that reminds me of. God. I think I got enough of that game. I got all the achievements in that game. Oh, I see. I got. I, I have. That was the game where I. Oh, oh I didn't get the last achievement. The one point. Oh. Because I wanted to have. I wanted to have, have all my achievements in this game. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, I rented that game from Blockbuster back when Blockbuster was around. Yeah, I rented it, and um, I was sick that week that I rented it, and so I, I was like, I forget what it was. If I didn't go to school or I didn't, I didn't have anything else to do. Maybe it was like during the summer or something. But I was sick, and I, I had nothing else to do. I couldn't like hang out with friends and stuff, and. Um, so I just I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna get all the achievements in Bullet Witch <laughs> since I rented this game. I'm just gonna play it. Uh, oh wait, that, is that for both of us or just for you or? Wait. Oh, it's still you. There we go. Oh, okay. That was weird. I had to back out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you'd hit cancel. It's weird. Oh, skip. There we go. <laughs> uh, oh. Um. Power. I don't know what any of these are, though. I think skip like... Alright, maybe I'll take one off reach. Yeah, I'll just do that. I don't know. This is the best part of the game. <laughs> Some of them sound like chickens. Rack up points? Or... I don't know. I mean, during that, do we actually rack up points? Or, I mean, do the points actually matter? Or? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good question. Uh, Tag. Yeah, oh yeah, every time. Fuck saving your preferences. <laughs> yeah. Or even realizing that this is already happened. <laughs> you know what the music in the menu? It, this, the music reminds me a lot of Persona in the menu. Uh, I have, yeah, that's another series I need to play. Persona. I want to get a Vita, but I was waiting, I, I, I only want to get a Vita
for what I got a PSP for is the emulators. <laughs> oh, see, I wanna <laughs> but they don't have they don't have emulators out on Vita yet. I don't think anybody is um, developed like yet. Sound sound shape on the Vita. I can play. I can play um, Persona 4, Golden, but more importantly, I can I can get all the pinball tables on the pinball arcade and then just cross play so I can have like play pinball fucking everywhere. I really like pinball, and the pinball arcade is fucking. So. I don't know if it's been more entertaining or not, but I realized we haven't really been talking about this game at all. <laughs> We've just been having a conversation. <laughs> yes. Okay, so you just broke a boulder and that piece is spazzing the hell out and just oh, flew up into the sky. So yeah, so this game is like... It's not good, but it's like not terrible. Yeah, I mean it's well, it's like EDF. It's it's not good, but it's except EDF is one more. Fun. E yeah, EDF is better than this so far, but um, but yeah, like it's it's entertaining. This, you know, what this is like is if if a team with less of a budget, which is already like saying a lot, <laughs> decided to take it. Picture someone, half the team that makes all the Dynasty Warrior games, slashed their budget and was like, make a sexy zombie game. Yeah. Oh, it's a pair of legs we missed. Look at that jiggle. <laughs> that's so weird. That's not natural. It's not sexy. Well, that's jiggle physics for you. That's what it usually is in games. Yeah, so I don't, I don't know if the... What are the different orbs? Are there's like yellow, yellow and red experience. ones. Okay. Red's probably health, I guess. So at some point, are we supposed to have some kind of challenge? Or <laughs> are we supposed to be in danger of dying at some point? See, all I, when I was playing this before, I remember playing and getting to a part that was just like really difficult. <laughs> presenting itself here. Wait a minute. What? What? You heard that too, right? Yeah. I hit I hit right bumper right when she said it, but it's not doing it now. I don't even know what is what is this? Like I don't know. Quick next area. Oh Flashy City Wait, hold on. That's kind of cool. So you hold right bumper to do like different attacks. Oh shit. Yeah, it's like a completely new attack set. All right, let's go. Wish I could sprint, but. <laughs> this place has two areas, dude. Two areas. Oh man, getting fancy now. <laughs> in a way, in the smallest of ways, this game reminds me of Panning and Stop. <laughs> in the very smallest of ways. Yeah, that yeah, that show is so fun. Yeah. Well that's Gynax for you. <laughs> Trolling everybody since nineteen ninety five.
Oh, okay, yeah, that's the same thing. Which, I don't know why you would need a lock on, but... <laughs> yeah, I was like, it's a whole new attack set. <laughs> I guess we go this one. Oh. I don't know what's up with that. <laughs> Which, um, because I was behind you, I got to walk through the back wall. <laughs> well, at least you didn't get stuck outside it. That would have sucked. Yeah. Giant crows. Yeah. Yeah, this part kind of reminds me of Bullet Witch. Were there spirit walls in the latest, um, Devil May Cry? I don't know. I don't know. I've only played, uh, the first Devil May Cry. I don't think I beat it. And then, um, I beat, I beat the second one, but yeah, I, yeah, that was, that was a series that I was apathetic about, like how we were with Scrapland, pretty much. I was just like, like, after I played the first one, I was like, that was awesome, and the second one was pretty cool, but why are we, why are we doing more? Yeah, I didn't really like two, but I liked it. I thought it was good. Uh, about it that there wasn't like a whole lot of like great art direction. Yeah. Did I just pick up a picture of Jesus? Possibly. <laughs> it looked like an orb that had a picture of Jesus in it. In editing, you'll have to like have a screenshot of that or something. Don't give me more work. <laughs> okay, don't do that then, so they won't be expecting it. Just completely cut out that I even said that. <laughs> the smoke blood monster of some sort. Uh, okay. <laughs> I can't lock on to him anymore. There we go. What is this thing? Oh. That's kind of an obnoxious game mechanic. <laughs> you have to sling your sword every once in a while. Oh, wait, you use it for powers? Check it out. No, that's your what button did you press? Uh left bumper. Did. Yeah, because I think you have to have the full sword or something. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I mean, this is why I quit, actually. Why? This monster. <laughs> I don't know how to kill it. Yeah, what is this even? <laughs> Crimson makeup complete. I don't know what that means. Was that an achievement or something? Yeah, we're staying in this, like, demon form forever. <laughs> huh. Oh, oh, I did that. This is like the first enemy we've run into where it's like... Yeah, there's gotta be... Yeah, so where else do we have to go? Oh wait, oh, oh, hold on. You gotta come this way. There's a whole bunch of zombies now.
Did you do that? Yeah. Oh, okay. And when do we go out of this form? We've been in this form forever. Did it glitch? I don't know. There's an exclamation point here. Wait, let me check something. Prize? Um, so there's no... Zero out of zero. Okay. I, I thought there might be a controls or something. That's what I did. Oh, bathe in a, bathe in a large amount of splatter. do that too. Um. Oh, that was what I picked up. That was Jesus. There's a. I saw a crow or something. Yeah. A crow. yeah. Oh. Wait. There we go. I'm still dead. Yeah. I'm a weird man, so I'm gonna look up how to play this one. <laughs> yeah, I like how there's a tips in the in the options, the pause menu, but there's tips. no tips. Go fuck <laughs> tips? You want tips? Too bad. Zombies are spawning. Oh, and I can't... I can't change targets. <laughs> Maybe there's some way to do it. There's a Wii version? Yeah. That's bizarre. Underground parking key was obtained. Okay. Now it's open. You're still dead. And I'm about to die. <laughs> but we got a key of some kind. Oh, you're in rampage mode. I don't know how to get out of it, though. Yeah. I need to go this way right now. Apparently die you die if you're in rampage mode for yeah, too long. You, you do a lot more damage, but you lose health. Yeah, there doesn't seem to be a way to get out of it. Can I make it to the end? I'm still dead, you're still dead. I mean, I'm not, well, I'm still dying. 
Wait, what happened? I don't know. I went into the parking garage, and then you you came with me, even though you were still lying on the ground. And then I'm still in rampage mode. Oh, sweet! Oh. Oh, there's a dude oh, I can't who wants this. to rape her, it sounds like. <laughs> That's what it sounded like! I don't know why I s Man, I've been... Well, he at least wants to fight. Yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> This is the boss. Oh, the boss. great. Yeah, with, with one health bar. Look how tall he is. Jeez. You're all for short. You're a little girl. Yeah. What about I don't fucking kill the rampage meter? Yeah. <laughs> don't tell me we're gonna start from that point again in so the what same. What the fuck was that smoke monster? I don't know. Google isn't helping me. No one plays this game. <laughs> we should just go play Don't Star. Right? <laughs> Can you play Don't Star? No, I'm not. Oh my god. <gasps> Dude, giant zombie! That was awesome! Here we go. Oh, uh, the blood on your weapon doubles your blade and double blade you get damage if you get stuck in anything. Huh. I'm not sure if that's a good mechanic or not. I don't know. It Is seems- the game we're playing? I mean, it seems like it might be annoying, but... Reach I don't know. Increased. Reach increased. Three point get. I feel like I just remember reading that skill is like the most important thing fucking doing it. Alright. I tried to learn about this game when I, I wanna it. I wanna do vitality, a little bit at least. And power, I think. Don't be a bitch. <laughs> oh, there's a lot oh, you get a lot more points, never mind. You got went up two levels, because remember I died. I was dead oh, for a while. That's right, yeah. Oh yeah. What the fuck was that smoke thing? I don't know. This from Lost. I don't know. Oh, so now we're talking to this guy, even though we beat the shit out of him. Your souls. <laughs> she wants to eat your souls. <laughs> Where'd you buy this game? Because I, I didn't know you could. Stop. Uh oh. It was pre owned. Uh. I, I think I bought it for like $2. <laughs> like. $4. Her <laughs> boobs were just like. You need to look for um, next time GameStop's having a sale on pre owned shit and just bring like $20 and see <laughs> how many games we can get. Like less than one. <laughs> no, if we go pre owned like old shit, we can probably uh, get Uh, really at least old. Five. I don't know. Last time I was in GameStop, which was a long time ago, pre-owned games were hella expensive. Yeah, but if I don't know why I just ones. said hella, but... <laughs> I don't know, it just happens, like, the, those words <laughs> it's like, I don't know why I'm saying totes, I hate that word, but I keep using it. <laughs> uh, cuh, uh. You know they expect a game to sell zero copies when they don't even bother like do redubbing like redubbing it when it's you know like there's not a lot of dialogue like yeah. the Yakuza series is fucking awesome. I haven't finished any of those games, but I own one and two and I played a lot of them. Yeah. And I get why they stopped translating them because there's a lot of fucking dialogue. Yeah. But there's like eight lines of dialogue every hour in this game. Yeah. <laughs> that one just stopped and stood there. Yeah. <laughs> just gets ridiculous. Even though it just fucking devolves to us doing that, I still <laughs> like it. Like, <laughs> I just want to sit there and mash the button and watch the little zombies die. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. Hospital of the Dead. Is there only five chapters? No, that's as far as I got. Oh, okay. What? Wait, what? 
is there was no option for multiplayer huh. Oh, that's right! This game has levels that aren't multiplayer. Oh, well, that's dumb. Well, hey, EDF, you could play the whole game multiplayer. Man, we need to do. We should do a let's play EDF. Uh, that game. I mean, as much as I love that game, it's so deep. Deep as in like long. long. Yeah, that's what, what I. That's what I should have said. Uh, the second one. I didn't play. I haven't played I that one yet. Yeah, I haven't played that one yet, so we could do that one. Look at how much more screen fidelity I get when we're playing yes. one player. All that- See? So much more boob jiggles on screen. <laughs> Why is everyone pissed off about Laura Croft's tits when this happens? <laughs> well, because this is Japanese, it's expected. Say, oh, Japan. Yeah. Oh. More, like, buttons on it than normal, but... Yeah, it was just really squished before. <laughs> I don't even get to play what the, the fuck. The power of my baneful blood had weakened. Oh, that's why you've been kidnapped. Oh, okay. That's right, cause she yeah. Stupid dumbass, why did <laughs> you still kidnap Cameron? Come on! <laughs> If only it were actually my fault and not part of the game. <laughs> that would be really funny. Yeah, be that funny. it'd be more. Awesome. Yeah, it would. Yeah, it, it would, would actually. Make this stupid game even dumber, but in like a an interesting way. Like, yeah. This is still, this is far more interesting than Scrap than it was. Yeah. I can't tell we're recording these on the same day. You're gonna upload them like years apart. Like you're gonna upload uh, Scrapland like what, next what year. The schedule is we haven't worked out a schedule yet, but it'll, yeah, they're gonna go apart. I don't know why that one door is red. Like the side, the one side of it's red. Oh. And it's green. <laughs> I don't know if that means if I go in, I can't get out. Like. The combat, I mean, again, from what I've seen of Lollipop Chainsaw, the combat in this game looks smoother than Lollipop Chainsaw. No, it's not. It's not? Okay. Lollipop Chainsaw... You say it's it's it not. it looks smoother? Lollipop Chainsaw, there may be, um... Maybe some more animation priority or something? But... The combat in Lollipop Chainsaw is better than this. I mean, there are no- there are combos in Lollipop Chainsaw. There are no- there's a combo meter, but we're just hitting the same button yeah. over and over again. Like, yeah. Yeah, and it probably had a bigger budget than this game. Oh god, yes. yeah. I mean, we. Well, yeah, I see. Yeah, I say. I realized the the the, the, the air of your ways when you yeah, said probably probably like, it had a bigger budget. <laughs> Definitely. You know what's fucking awesome? It was last year at PAX. Um, I had gotten the chance to check out Lollipop Chainsaw, and that was when they had. A I can't remember her name, but you know the the uh, actor, like the cosplay actress that they got to play. The yeah. Version of Juliet. Yeah, we I were forget her name to too. her and stuff because it was before that whole thing happened where she got kicked out and all that. Oh yeah. And um. Grab that. We said we thing. talked about Doctor Who for like ten minutes. She's like, wearing a Doctor <laughs> Who shirt. And she's like, oh, I love Doctor Who. We talked about it. It was great. God, who doesn't love Doctor Who these days? I mean, I don't, I don't watch it a whole lot. Um, you should, you should but, watch the Lonely Gods and uh, follow along with us. Yeah. <laughs> Old Doctor Who's fucking awesome. I mean, there's some really bad episodes in there, but like a lot of it's great. Yeah, one of my friends was telling me that um, a lot of Old Doctor Who episodes, like the really old ones, like 60s and 70s or whenever it started, like a lot of those are, yeah, a lot of those are lost. Because uh, the... Not a, 
there's, well, I mean, compared to what you'd think of if you, like, you know, there'd be, like, a lost episode of a show, like, there's a, there are a lot of lost episodes. Yeah. But, um, for the most part, not, not, nothing uh, beyond the second Doctor. Huh. I believe. Um, there are a few, like, I think maybe, like, six or eight stories, because the way you watch, so you, you've watched some modern Doctor Who. Yeah. Yeah. I well yeah, really like most of the stuff I've seen is from the tenth doctor I wanna say. No, ninth then. Whoever the Frackleson? Yeah yeah yeah. From G.I. Joe? Yeah, yeah, ninth doctor. Yeah, that's that's where most of the ones I've seen. Basically, you know, um the way old Doctor Who worked is it was a half an hour show and stories were usually like four to six episodes long. Yeah. Um so a lot of them aren't there aren't a lot of there are probably like uh, there are ones there are stories where there everything's gone and then there's somewhere just some episodes are missing. Hmm. But yeah, like that's actually um a, a lot of the second Doctor stuff is gone. And it was because back then reruns weren't a thing. TV was still so new that no one like they didn't think they'd be using them after it aired, like or they sold them to another. Right. Yeah. And the tape the tapes the tapes are really expensive. Yes. Yeah, so what they, I heard. They recorded over them. Right, yeah. Yeah. It was poor hind it was poor uh forethought is what it was. Yeah. So yeah, a lot of it's gone. And that's actually Kate and I um are she's taking so long too. We're on I think season four. Yeah, season four. And there was No, there wasn't a single complete storyline in it. Huh. Like wow. all every every story had some missing. So and for the the way we've done Lonely Gods, for those who don't know, is up until around this point we've been skipping the lost episodes. And then we have lost episode specials. Well season four is an entire lost episode special and we've also been watching the reconstructions because there's audio for every single episode that was lost. Oh. They just don't have video, but they have a lot of like, That's photographs weird. taken on the set and stuff. So people have like pieced it together with different shots and you know, from like plot summaries and stuff huh. to recreate the episodes. That's really that's really interesting though that the show, the the, the video got lost. They still have the audio, yeah. and there was pictures even taken on set. That's interesting. Say surgery oral? Uh, it's in the surgery oral. Yeah, it was, it was, it was camera shit. <laughs> it won't turn. Like it won't go the other way. <laughs> I want it to face the other I want it to be behind me, not in front of me. Oh, oh god, fuck. no! <laughs> what is Here's the point of that even? Cloud on Chambara. And it's not, there's no end in it. It's Tony Chan Sada. My uh, couple semesters of Japanese are paying off. Yeah. Yeah, I tried to learn Japanese once. Yeah, I took I took three semesters of it. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't, I'm, I'm already forgetting a lot, but. Um... Yeah, I wanted to, and then I realized how hard it was. Put well, it, yeah. How much I didn't want to put into it. Yeah, when I got to my when I got to the fourth, what would have been the fourth semester, I didn't do it because the teacher that I wanted wasn't teaching it again. Um, and then I also it was my last semester in college, so I I didn't uh, uh, didn't want to take something like that in the last semester, and have it mess me up. What is it? Okay, smoke monster, blood monster. Or something. My rampage meter's building up. I don't want my rampage meter to build up. <laughs> I mean, I didn't look up rampage mode too. Maybe we can figure out. What are the blood smoke zombies about? Okay. Uh, how do you. Is there a way to find in the page? Because this is an FAQ, so I don't want to have to search all through it.
Wait, here we go, find in page. When they were at the video tape a little, like just do like a little video intro so they can see uh get a nice insight into the Geek Inside Laboratories Tampa branch. <laughs> Yeah. Our fucking ridiculous three screen or four technically four screen experience here. Yeah, fuck your two screen experience. Yep, there we go. This is also the only mode in which blood smoke zombies appear. The story mode. Okay. But what are they about? Blood Smoke Zombie. These only appear in story mode and never have to be defeated to proceed. They can only be defeated with. Oh, let me turn this sideways. <laughs> they can only. And zoom out. Now you gotta find it again. Hold on a second. I don't know how to work a friggin' smartphone. These only appear. They only can be defeated with cool combinations. With the chapter, the cool combinations, with the chapter they appear in determining just how many hits they require to be defeated. Once defeated for the first time, they'll drop the chapter ring you're playing on for the character you're playing as. After acquiring the ring they drop, blood smoke zombies will still appear but no longer drop anything. That's why I was increasing my, uh, oh. skill or whatever. Well, but we couldn't, we, but we couldn't defeat... We couldn't defeat that other one. Well, we have to have really high combos. Oh. And shit. Cool combinations of moves, too. Like, oh. Moves only to be defeated with really cool combos. Okay, yeah. Look up how to turn off rage or rampage. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. Um. Oni Chambara. Right now, I'm fucking die. How do you turn off the rage? You can't. No. <laughs> no. It's in you forever. Or how do you use an item? Because there are items that least restore my health. The only way I found to stop it is finding one of those goddess statues. You can't simply not use it, nor can you turn it off. You're forced into when your blood rage meter max out. It can help from time to time depending on the enemies in the area when you activate it. The only way to stop it is to use a character that doesn't get it. Anna, or maybe those DLC that are coming out, use the fragment of Goddess Statue or the main Goddess Statue. How do I use the statue? Or get us. Yeah. I know how to get into my Oh wait, I just fucking used one. Are you serious? I'm gonna stay in rage mode then. Wait until you guys unlock the hardest difficulty in the game. You play the entire game in rage mode. Really? <laughs> yeah. Shit. Rage mode is really the way to go, especially once you have a lot of vitality. Trust me, you'll all learn to love playing in this mode. Yeah, I mean, your health does go down really slow, so I mean, it's it's doable if you have healing items. I don't know why it wouldn't work before. I mean, I know the, the viewers can see me. They, they, they saw me pull up the fucking item menu. I was hitting yeah, the it's yeah, like it wouldn't, moron. yeah, it wouldn't do anything. Well, I mean, I am a moron, but I'm not... <laughs> I like there's an ad on game on Game Facts for Chuck E. Cheese's. <laughs> Chuck E. Cheese's still exist? Yeah. Shit. Of course, yeah. We still have one here. No one has fucking pinball. <laughs> that's really all I give a shit. Oh, that's true, yeah. Wait! They don't have pinball at Chuck E. Cheese? They have that one pinball machine. Maybe at Chuck E. Cheese. I didn't ask Chuck E. Cheese. I, you, I can't go to Chuck E. Cheese. I don't have a child. Oh, that's true, yeah. You can't go to Chuck E. Cheese without a child. Yeah. Game works doesn't happen. The only, I looked on I looked on Pinside, which is like the big pinball like website, and they have a map with pinball machines on it. So like places you can play. So oh. Like, uh, the cues are this laser tag place. Yeah. Has a couple of machines. Yeah, cues are. I remember cues are this has some pinball. That's, I mean that's one of the main reasons I want to go to uh, Disney Quest.
it's not just because Disney Voice is cool and all that shit is and like, it's interesting. But because not only do they have pinball machines, but they have the Tron Legacy pinball machine, uh. which is pretty highly rated. Like, people say it's a great machine, and I fucking love Tron. So... Yeah, I want to go. I want to go to Disney Quest to try out um, Discotron and uh, the Fix It Felix machine because I have it. Oh yeah! In fact, I think they have several of them. Oh shit! Then yeah. I, yeah. I didn't know really, because last time they usually don't have it. And they don't have any like on games. Which is the last time I went, that's all I wanted to play. And the only ones they have oh. are like, Go Go Safari, like huh. sit down with like a. Like, you don't even really use a gun in that game, you know, it's like paddling off giant frogs. And yeah, shit. yeah. Totally played the other version of that at, uh, we had like a go-kart track near us. Um, the one in Nebraska. Yeah. Um, which is the, the pirate oh. one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You see the soul get stuck in that time? Yeah, yeah, I saw that. How did you get it out? Or did it just... Oh, okay. You need to use a healing item. So. Well, that's just to turn off rage mode. Oh, okay. I was gonna say you could have left it on and then I just used it. The level is. Yeah, that's true. I don't want to use all of my healing items. God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Not only is it the end of the level, it didn't even really end. <laughs> it just stopped. <laughs> Fuck this game. <laughs> we should probably uh, call this this part this uh, episode completed. We're like 45 minutes in. Yeah. All right. But uh, yeah, this is this is this is a nice giant zombie. <laughs> This has already been a nice distraction from um, Scrap Land. Yes. So yeah, thank you for watching, and we will be back with more. See you soon.